Welcome back guys to the next Lego Brickling vlog for this week. Currently Sunday, October 16th at about 11 p.m. Uh, uploaded this vlog earlier today, of course. Uh, doing uh, better than expected, so I thank you guys all so much for that. Uh, kind of a longer one. And uh, this one right here, guys, uh, should be decently long. Uh, you know, filming my entire week. And uh, currently uh, editing and exporting the video for Monday. So, uh, you know, the video right after the last vlog. And uh, yeah, let's check Bricklink really quick. I uh, hit it with a refresh and uh, see what exactly is going on. So it looks like order wise, guys, just for today, let's see what we're at. Uh, $216, so definitely right on the money, uh, you know, of a solid day right here. And, uh, you know, kind of a lot of easy ones. Looks like, so looks like we got one that came in here, 56 lots, uh, you know, a little bit time consuming there, but uh, I'll be able to knock that one out no problem, especially with only being uh, 500 pieces. And then down here, guys, we got a, a big 207 lot one that I packed up earlier. Uh, it was the first thing I did when it came down here because I'm like, look, last thing I want to do is uh, be stuck, you know, Monday afternoon uh, rushing it and uh, went by very quick. Only took about maybe a little over an hour to pack up so uh, not too bad and that guy is a longtime customer uh, of the of the bricklink store i think this is his ninth order uh, all within the past like couple you know, i think maybe six months and uh he actually only looks like 30 minutes away from me so um you know always nice doing business with him and uh yeah i got a few of the other orders packed up over there and uh, i'll do the rest of these tonight actually what i'll probably do is once this is done exporting i will uh, start uploading this and uh, usually takes my videos about 25 to 30 minutes to uh, you know to upload to youtube and i will go ahead and uh you know, we'll just go ahead and pack these up as I'm doing that. So then after that, I'll film another video, uh, knock that out, edit it, upload it, and then go to the gym again. I went to the gym yesterday, last night, for the first time in four weeks, and uh, felt very, very good to get back. Uh, you know, that's always a good feeling getting back in the gym. And uh, I did, you know, 45 minutes of weights, 45 minutes of, uh, you know, cardio, hit a nice, you know, shoulder, chest, and tri day. And, uh, you know, the strength is still there. Basically, I was able to put up everything I still was, you know, a month ago. And, uh, you know, 45 minutes on the stair step or never hurt. And uh, I, I usually, so my, my plan is I go to the gym at about two in the morning, get back by about five in the morning. Uh, my gym's about 30 minutes away or so in my old uh, hometown. Uh, that's just the gym I like going to. And uh, then uh, basically, you know, I, I got back at about 5 a.m. I usually take a shower again and then go back to, uh, you know, work for four or five hours. But, but last night was not the case since the second I hit my bed, I went to sleep and I did not wake up for like 11 hours after. But uh, yeah, should be all fully recharged charge and everything and uh, getting back in the swing of things uh never felt better honestly just one night in the gym again after uh you know all these nights of not going in the gym and you know eating pretty poorly uh truly just uh it changes your mind you know it really just helps your mindset and it's truly remarkable so uh yeah that's everything for right now guys and uh, we'll see what's going on oh and also i forgot i, I totally forgot the, another big thing i uh, started the you're know, putting these out on the table uh you know the four of those volkswagen so uh, this is, uh, I'd say roughly halfway done. Actually, maybe more of like a third of the way done. Uh, still quite a few big bags. Of course, got all the small bags. Uh, definitely going to go all the way over here. I'm actually not even too sure how many lots this is, if I'm being honest. I don't remember offhand, but um, this I'm expecting. I'm hoping to get it done by Wednesday. Actually, I'm kind of, I need it done by Tuesday, actually, now that I think about it, because, like I said, Wednesday through Saturday, I've got some plans. But, you know, hopefully I can put this on by Tuesday. And then, like I said, guys, another big thing will be working on the mock. So that's kind of the start off for this week, guys. We'll see, of course, where I'm at by the end of it. But uh, this week should be pretty good. And, uh, you know, for my mental health, for the store, for the mock and everything like that. So, uh, again, I'll, I'll keep you guys posted. All right, guys, I had to include this really quick. Uh, I don't know why I have not checked this or not remember the number, but uh, the Volkswagen right here I'm parting out. I'm parting out four of them, 538 lots. So that's actually my third most... Uh, you know, most lots in a set I've ever parted out. And uh, yeah, that explains why it looks like 538 lots will literally probably take up uh, two thirds of this, uh, you know, longer white table even. And uh, wow. So I don't know if I should have looked at that number or not, because I'm not going to lie. It's definitely a little bit more of a daunting task, uh, you know, sorting it. And uh, that will take forever to put on. Uh, you know, usually your know, big sets take me about two hours to put on my store. Uh, this will probably take every bit of three minutes. I mean, luckily 145 new lots. So the new lots are very easy, you know, just to take out of the cup, you know, put into a drawer, put into a tackle box. But, uh, you know, having to consolidate uh, almost 400 lots. Yeah, I don't know. Again, I, I hate to be optimistic and I hate to be negative, but uh, knock on wood, hopefully I can get it done. Uh, again, at the latest, like Wednesday afternoon. So we'll see where we're at. But uh, that number is uh, absolutely insane. And I kind of regret seeing that number now.
So real quick update for a Monday morning right now. It's about the one in the morning, watching a little bit of John Campia, uh, catching up on his uh, long Ask Me Anything he did. I'm actually partying out a couple of these small friend sets. So uh, as you guys know, I've got the big part out going on over there. I don't think I'll be able to probably get to that until, I'm not going to lie, probably Saturday. I'll you know, probably take a couple more days worth of uh, sorting and then to really be able to sit down and uh, knock it all out at once, it'll probably be Saturday. So uh, throughout this week, I definitely want to get these uh, smaller front sets on. So I'm knocking out the two small ones tonight. I've got a little free time until I'm going to the gym in about a half hour. So I should be able to knock out this uh, second one right here. Uh, you know, four, one, six, nine, seven, got six of them and I already did the other small set. And uh, because another thing too is for the next three days, like I kind of said, uh, you know, in my free time, I'll be, you know, slowly kind of doing those bags and, uh, you know, filling out this uh, table with the parts, but I also really have to work on the mock. So, um, the orders are packed up. Uh, I will film a video after the gym, uh, edit that as I'm uploading it. I will uh, pack that 56 lot one, uh, you know, the order that came in, then fully pack them all up and, uh, you know, upload that video, pre-record for Friday, and then, uh, you know, pack everything up, go to the post office and go to bed and uh, then wake up and uh, get into my uh, regular week of, uh, yeah, just staying busy. I mean, like I said, I've been very proud of myself uh, for once in a while. Uh, you know, again, knock on wood. I've been knocking on wood a lot lately, but, uh, you know, staying uh, just busy, you know, doing stuff. You know, everything I'm doing has a purpose. A very little, uh, you know, kind of just, you know, relaxation time, I feel. Uh, you know, I'm either doing a video, uh, parting out a set, you know, sorting pieces, and uh, for this week, you know, you know, working in the mock. So, uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys all in the next clip of uh, just staying busy. Guys, welcome back to another clip on the vlog, currently Monday, October 17th at about 10 p.m. I've been watching Nerd Theory for the past, like, hour or so. I kind of had a late start tonight, but uh, a lot of stuff that will uh, have to get done tonight that's kind of easy. So, uh, luckily, I can kind of, you know, stay up a little bit later and uh, not really have to do too much hard stuff today. But, uh, yeah, so basically what I've been doing, I got that small friend set on. Uh, then I uploaded a video uh, you know, that I recorded yesterday, uh, uploaded the video for Friday. So, uh, that is currently up. And also what I'll be doing tonight then is, uh, recording the video for, uh, Tuesday and Thursday, pretty much like I kind of told you guys, I, uh, I really wanted to kind of pre-record, or you know, kind of get in the habit of just kind of being at least a couple days ahead. You know what I mean? Since, uh, that's really what I feel like burnt me out there a couple times there. Uh, you know, because for like, 45 days straight literally every morning like there was a few times i'd be able to get the video out by the, the night before but a lot of times it was literally you know 9 a.m the day of and uh, that's why there's quite a few videos that were like uploaded 15 minutes late just because of, like my wi-fi or whatever but uh that's kind of the plan for tonight uh really just kind of pre-recording uh videos and everything between myself and big shout out to my dad uh he did not have to do this but it was a uh, pretty awesome he was able to finish sorting out um all of this stuff here so we got all four of these volkswagens all sorted out so actually it works out kind of perfectly i'll kind of have an easy night tonight uh, on monday i still have to pack up that 58 lot order but i'll be doing that as i'm uploading the next video in the background uh, i've already got that all set up right here shouldn't probably take me more than like 30 minutes so uh tonight like i said pack up that order knock out two more videos and then just work on the mock like i'll just be able to like easily put in like another like two three four hours on the mock over there uh which again i don't want to show you guys in this video although technically i mean i guess well I, no i won't show you guys in this clip i was gonna say technically you guys will be seeing this video a day after the mock update so if you guys have not seen the mock update yet check out yesterday's video um again i've got quite a lot of stuff built right now and even more stuff planned uh you know before saturday comes so uh, we've got that going on and then tomorrow guys on tuesday i'll probably wake up uh you know 6 p.m have my breakfast get down here about 7 p.m and then uh literally from uh i don't doubt this would probably take me from about 7 p.m uh, all the way until midnight probably this would probably be every bit of a four to six hour process uh, putting all these parts on and then uh, but that'll be like i kind of told you guys earlier on this will be a big relief if i'm if i'm able to get all these parts on by by tuesday night uh you know that will literally between that and all the videos for the week being uploaded uh you know that will put a, a lot of pressure off me you know a big part out done for the week uh, videos up for the week where then I can literally just focus on the mock, uh, you know, get other stuff done, get even more ahead of myself and, uh, you know, get more stuff done, uh, you know, in advance and then also be able to enjoy some of those plans we got, uh, you know, for the weekend. So I'll, uh, I'll see you guys all the next clip and uh, tomorrow night uh, should basically be that. And uh, let's hope we can uh, get all this on tomorrow. Uh, definitely a pretty daunting task because uh, like I said, it's over 500 lots and uh, well, like 8,000 pieces. Although I guess, hey, really quickly, just for the heck of it, I like doing this just with all, you know, these Technic pins every time is uh, let's go ahead and consolidate these real quick. Let's uh, save myself five seconds for tomorrow. And again, if you guys want any of these Technic pins, uh, go ahead and buy them for me. I've got like 5,000 
and I think they're like two pennies each. But um, yeah, so I'm just gonna keep on adding to the bin right here. But on that note, guys, well, let me get back to work and I'll pick up with you guys again uh, either later tonight or tomorrow. So right now, guys, I'm currently on Wednesday, October 19th at about midnight. Uh, BrickLink is down for a whole entire hour right now, which uh, luckily I was able to get done what I wanted to get done before that happened. But the, basically what I did tonight was I consolidated everything that is not in a tackle box. So I basically, you know, knocked out probably about half of it. You know, it's very thinned out now. And, uh, you know, I'll just relieve a lot of pressure uh, tomorrow when I go to put this on. And, uh, you know, basically it'll be a lot less time sensitive. You know what I mean? Since, since at the end of the day, you know, when I'm doing 500 lots, uh, you know, last thing I want is to be sitting here for, you know, four or five hours on the same page on my computer and, you know, have the power go out or have anything like that happen, uh, you know, where it would mess up what I, you know, did. So I wanted to kind of, you know, uh, knock off as much time as I could. So then tomorrow, uh, you know, most of these are new lots here. And of course, you know, probably a few of these smaller pieces, uh, you know, are going into these tackle boxes, you know, consolidated. But uh, nonetheless, I mean, this right here should take me probably no longer than like an hour and a half, if that, because, uh, you know, there's 145 of these right here that are brand new lots, which that's, you know, very simple, you know, literally just put it into a new thing, number it, move on. And, uh, you know, consolidation at that point, uh, just do it by color, you know, black and blue first, uh, put it on this cart here, roll it in front of here and literally just go back and forth and knock that out pretty quickly. So, uh, that's what I did tonight. Uh, currently I'm going to go film an LBS response to, uh, for the week and then, uh, probably not edit that yet. Uh, I'll probably be done by one, uh, you know, one in the morning, which then at that point I'll pack up a couple of the orders and then at one thirty every night, uh, you know, in the morning, I guess I've been going to the gym, uh, you know, one thirty in the morning. So, uh, yeah, that'll be the night so far. Then after the gym, I'll probably edit up that video, uh, finish up packing any orders and, uh, basically go from there. But, uh, yeah, fourth night on this schedule and, uh, for what it's worth, uh, you know, knocking out everything I have to, and uh been you know pretty happy with everything i've been doing so uh, i'll see you guys all right welcome back everyone to the next clip to currently thursday at about uh, 5 30 a.m a very late start to the day and uh technically it was almost kind of like going to be a complete uh kind of reset day again uh for me uh you know i was still going to get a couple things done but uh, i was just very tired you know i've gone to the gym for the past five days uh you know for the first time in a month and a half and uh but, you know, I'm still down here. I'm going to do a couple things. Uh, honestly, and I'm, I kind of realize, you know, it is fully working. You guys don't see a ghost energy right here. And uh, because I, I'm just trying to get off those, you know, for what it's worth. I, they're still a great drink, I think. Uh, but, you know, at least for the next, like, two or three weeks, I really kind of want to stray away and probably not have any of those. And uh, basically what I got myself, though, is, you know, I've, I've been an, an avid coffee drinker. You know what I mean? I've been an avid coffee drinker for uh, all my life. Of course, you know, I'm a, I'm a fan of Dunkin' Donuts, Starbucks. But, uh, of course, you know, I don't want to be having a... Uh, preferably, especially when I'm trying to lose a little bit of weight, I, I'm not, I don't want to be having a, a 300 calorie cup of coffee, you know, every single morning uh, for no reason. But uh, basically what I bought, I bought some, you know, very low calorie uh, Starbucks cold brew, uh, medium roast, and a little bit of uh, French vanilla, uh, you know, like 15 calorie creamer. And, uh, and, and I can tell it's working since I'm pretty hyper right now, now that I'm kind of recording this video. But, uh, you know, I'm just doing a cup of that and, uh, you know, it's, it's working kind of just the same. Hopefully it does at least, you know, hopefully it gives me enough, uh, you know, energy that I need. And uh, what I can truly see is because my problem with coffee in the past is, you know, I drink it and I crash very quick after, like within like an hour, I, I just crash after drinking coffee. But compared to like those energy drinks, you know, I would drink you know, I would kind of sip on them for like say three hours in a row and like I would kind of be fine for like those entire three or four or five hours. But uh, we'll see how the coffee works though, guys. But today's plan uh, for now, which again, technically, you know, I've got a couple more hours left in my day. Again, you know, I kind of was doing nothing for the first little bit, watching a little too much YouTube and, and bumming around, but uh, down here for a little bit now. Uh, uploading today's video, LBS response to episode number 83. I'm currently gonna have to make the thumbnail. I'm uh, gonna edit the video then and then uh, order wise today uh, no order is going to be shipping out today I don't think I don't think I'll be able to get to these but a very nice day uh, right here $217 uh, you know just for uh, you know so basically run of the mill day you know that's like a average day uh, a little bit higher than average I like to say $200 is my average day uh, you know revenue wise but uh, yeah very easy too. only 47 lots and a couple of nice little orders here and uh, yeah so we got that going on and then again this is kind of where it all falls apart you know uh, I was able to do half of this last night. I'm not too sure if I filmed that. I put away half of this, but realistically, if I really want to have a very successful week and uh, not risk, you know, being behind again after being ahead at the beginning of the week is 
uh, I have to put this other half on. So um, we'll see. I might have to go maybe make myself another cup of cold brew. And, uh, you know, after like an hour, you know, since editing the video and stuff, you know, that's like kind of top priority. Uh, since, you know, I got to get it out for today, actually. Uh, so I got to get that up, got to get it out of the way. And uh, then I will uh, see if I have time to put the rest of that set on. Since uh, then that will basically make me be able to, you know, relax for the entire weekend and not have to worry about putting more parts on. Uh, since this is like a 9,500 uh, piece part out, and then basically at that point then, like I said, you know, today's, you know, technically my Wednesday when I wake up in eight hours, you know, middle of Thursday, uh, you know, for my Thursday day, uh, you know, then I've got that plan. And then afterwards is basically going to be more all mock work. And then tomorrow I'm seeing Black Adam. Uh, but other than that, it's all mock work. And then uh, going into Saturday, the mock update, this vlog on Sunday, and uh, everything should be pretty decent. But uh, there's basically that, guys. And uh, if it tells you anything, what, uh, you know, not going to college for three years does to you, my handwriting is absolutely atrocious. I mean, look at that, literally absolutely terrible. Luckily, I can read it, but uh, damn, like when I start writing, I literally feel like I've never wrote before when I go to write. But uh, yeah, there's that, guys. I'll see you guys all in the next clip. All right, guys, so I'm down here the next night. And uh, as you guys can tell, everything is 100% cleared up. And then we've got uh, some of the stuff I got to consolidate and change remarks for. Uh, not too bad. Not as bad as I thought. You know, that's only, what, maybe maybe 30 things right there. So I should probably be able to knock that out within at least 30 minutes. And then coming over here, guys, I guess I'll do this firsthand with you right here. So, uh, you know, currently I'm adding, uh, you know, for the entire part out, uh, 9,000 items, 537 lots for about $1,700. Uh, you know, naturally, I usually run a bit of a sale on my store as is. Uh, so they take off even 10% of that, just for kind of for the average uh, sale price. So we're down to, let's say, even a conservative 1500 bucks, And uh, I paid what, 80 times four, so about 320, maybe 350 with tax. So we're right at about a four X right there. And sure, you know, not everything's gonna sell instantly. It's not like it's, you know, $1,200 profit uh, within a week, but uh, yeah, very nice addition to the store. And uh, let's go ahead and upload the items right here. And uh, it's always the most stressful part. Let's hope everything goes through fine. There we go. So items successfully processed, and then let's take a gander over at the, uh, the store side, and we'll see what my numbers are at right now. Uh, we are at 444,196 uh, items and 8,177 uh, lots right there. So uh, beautiful. Uh, like I said, now that's uh, you know going to be a you know a stress-free weekend on the part out. Uh, I'll probably just maybe knock out these couple of small friend sets, and then uh, starting Monday. Uh, actually, let's take a look over here. Let's take a quick look over here what I got left. Uh, here's the boxes for those. Those are actually going out to the trash right now. And then uh, over here, so it looks like probably what I'll part out next is probably these five Luigi, uh, or I guess there's five Haunt and Seek sets right here. I got five of these, and uh, that'll probably be, uh, yeah, I'll start this on Monday, and then we'll pretty much go from there, I guess. Yeah, other than that, I'll probably part out these city sets maybe next week as well, but uh, I kind of sucked everything on the shelves right now. I've only got two or three of, so uh, no really big part outs, and uh, you know, clearing season is pretty much done, but uh, I got to start kind of picking through these uh, sets, and uh, yeah, so overall, guys, very happy. Uh, I just got to pack up uh, some orders for today. I did not ship out anything yesterday, um, but so I got to kind of catch up and uh, get everything ready to ship out uh, today. Like I said, it's about Friday, 5 a.m., and then uh, after that, all just mock work ready for Saturday or, you know, ready for yesterday's mock update, which again, go check that out if you guys have not. Uh, you know, I, I have a, a pretty big Lego Star Wars mock going on in my channel right now. So on that note, guys, uh, let's uh, close off this clip and uh, we'll kind of catch up probably maybe tomorrow and that'll pretty much be it for the video. Really quick for any of you guys that are watching current moment and made it this far in the video. Uh, if you guys want to place a BrickLink order at my store and get free shipping, just uh, put uh, the word Chrome Darth Vader uh, in the order notes and uh, I'll know that you made it, uh, you know, this far into the video and uh, you guys will get free shipping. Or, you know, I'll, I'll refund your shipping, uh, you know, once it charges you and uh, everything like that. So, yeah, again, shout out to you if you made it this far in the video. And if you guys want to place an order, uh, get free shipping. So, guys, coming into the last clip for this uh, week's vlog, it's uh, currently Saturday at about 4.30 uh, a.m. And uh, basically, yeah, this is the last clip for the for the weekend. Uh, basically, just closing up shop here pretty soon uh, for the BrickLink uh, side for the weekend. I've just got a few orders to pack up. Uh, everything that came in yesterday, uh, let's see, about $102 uh, so far in the last, uh, what, 16 hours or 13 hours or whatever. So, uh, not too bad. You know, we'll probably end up being a, a pretty uh, good day. Not too bad, though. Only 80 lots. Uh, you know, this should only take me probably an hour to pack up. So, 
so I'll uh, you know save it for a couple more hours from now uh, pack it up get it out in the post office and then uh, basically yeah, the whole entire thing uh, with the mock is uh, you know I'm trying my best to get as much progress done uh, you know the video has to go out at 2 30 p.m. today uh, as I'm recording this so um, you know I got to kind of finish uh, you know filming it and actually film it you know by probably noon so uh, you know, I could probably put another four or five hours into the mock, uh, you know, not including uh, packing up these orders here. So, um, yeah, some good progress, I'll admit. A little bit less than I was hoping, but I guess I'll truly kind of see where I'm going to be at in a couple hours, though. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to do the thumbnail here in a second as well. I'm going to focus on that. I got to order new business cards, too. I'm running out of this uh, batch of a 1,000. And uh, let me know, guys, should I change anything up on these? I've had this design for about two years now the only thing that obviously changed was i took out the one and the three in here and uh, let me know i mean should i change it off or, or change it out actually uh, i'll show you guys see this is my very first business card ever right here back in 2013 so uh there's that one then my newest one i, I kind of like the design i might change it up a bit though let me know if you guys have any ideas down below but i've got to do that uh this weekend also since that's uh, the only you know amount that i have left and then i got starting off next week uh you know on monday when I come down here, I will start parting out uh, these sets. I've got five of the 71401 uh, Haunt and Seek uh, right here. And, uh, you know, that will be, I want to say 245 lots. So not too bad. Will definitely be a nice, uh, you know, sight to see after doing 530 from that Volkswagen. So uh, that I'll probably be able to get this fully on by Wednesday. And then again, slowly do those friends sets throughout it. But uh, yeah, not too bad, guys. Uh, you know, closing off this week with a pretty successful week. I had a uh, a pretty lackluster and lazy Wednesday, which kind of sucks. But uh, other than that, everything kind of bounced back. And uh, at the end of the day, nothing bad happened this week. Just kind of another average week of getting everything done, keeping myself busy. But uh, that's basically all, guys. I'll pick up the vlog again on Sunday night. And uh, thank you guys for all the support on these. Uh, last week did really well, like 3,300 views, I think. So I'll see you guys all, uh, you know, starting off the next vlog or... Of course, you know, I do daily uploads on this channel. And again, go check out the mock update yesterday. Uh, some good progress, and uh, that will be coming out uh, every week for the next, uh, you know, five or six weeks. So I'll see you guys all in the next video. Bye, guys, and stay safe.